So you want to do a world conquest as a minor nation, like for example, uh, Luxembourg, Liberia, Oman or uh, Albania. In this video I will show you how. So this strategy works for almost all minor countries, um, but I'll be using Luxembourg as an example. So to do this you will have to research paratroopers. Um, Uh, and uh, turn fascist so the first thing I'll do is uh, get 150 pp and uh, hire a fascist demagogue for production you'll be needing transport planes uh, to uh, use the paratroopers and uh, now I have the 150 political power I will uh, hire the fascist demagogue and uh, I will turn fascist so when I get 10% uh, popularity I will open up political discourse and when I get 40% I will uh, discredit government and uh, then I will turn fascist while you're waiting you can uh, do uh, uh, the industrial focuses so I will do two armament efforts and then rush the research slot. Uh, for construction you can build um, uh, air bases so you can uh, put your uh, airplanes up. For research uh, you can do whatever. I'm, uh, I will be doing tanks and uh, I'm just researching trucks and anti-air too so I can uh, request it from Italy and Germany later so industry doesn't really matter right now because you're so small so I will uh, prioritize uh, the military okay I will be building paratroopers that are uh, one battalion large uh, because they are very cheap I don't need uh, good paratroopers I just need uh, paratroopers there's an exploit with uh, airplanes that you can uh, you can duplicate and then deselect one and delete so now you get 80 manpower uh, I will be doing this you don't have to uh, it's just much easier um, it's an exploit so if you don't want to do it you don't have to but I'll I'll be doing it I actually changed my mind on the paratroopers I'll be doing the six widths I can turn fascist now so I'll do that and the first thing I will do is justify a war goal on the Dutch East Indies um, when I declare war on them Netherlands will join I kill them and then I puppet the Netherlands or the Dutch East Indies and take their manpower uh, one very important thing is don't join the Axis uh, Dutch East Indies will get guaranteed and uh, this strategy won't work so don't join Axis yet uh, I will show you what to do when uh, you're going to declare war now I have the war goal so what I what I will do is join the axis and wait one hour uh, now I'm in the axis and I can declare war so now I'm at war with the Netherlands I'll take my paratroopers Move them closer. Okay. Um, you can't just spare drop right on the victory points because they are uh, probably garnison it. Okay, very important to don't call Germany into the war. They will take in the peace conference. We don't want that. We have a guy sacrificing himself.
we really need Rotterdam. Okay. Oh, Rotterdam is open. Last time. First attack. Okay, we just have to survive 24 hours now. If they don't take Amsterdam, we're in luck. Close. Cl Let's go. Okay. Take all of Netherlands. Set the light. Dutch is in this. Okay. That took a while. It usually takes uh, not so long. So now what I what what I will do is create a colonial division. Copy this one. Add artillery. Remove recon. And then I'll train an army of that of that. So I just need manpower, which I can magically get from an airplane. So now we'll wait for World War Two, and then I'll pair drop France. For pair dropping uh, France, you will need to pair drop the victory point. Uh, the cities with uh, the most Witcher points, so Paris has the most, 50, and Orleans has 15, so you want to pair up there too, and uh, now you want to pair up on Calais, and Lil, because uh, you have to. Uh, if you just take a lay, you won't control it. You have to take uh, Lil too, so you control the state. And Tour is uh, ten victory points. And Le Havre is also ten. Uh, yes, that should be enough. But uh, just to be sure, I'm going to pair up Amien and another one bit five. True, yeah. Okay, so the war started. I will join. And um, and uh, now I will pair up. Okay, France is done. Now we will in invade the UK. Okay, I want pair drop. Uh, first, I will just put uh, a pair uh, trooper here to see uh, if there are any people here. Let's go. So there isn't anyone in Portsmouth. So let's go there. Okay, now everyone go there and. Now I will put two people on the outside as a buffer, so the, they can uh, so as a distraction, so they don't take the port instantly. Now we kill UK. We encircle London. 
We are going. Oh, that's not good. Don't take London. We will give them a chance to take it back. We are going to encircle London and do an exploit to get more, uh, more score. You see, we have right now we have 16% war score. If we kill uh, the division in London, we get more. We have 17%. Now we have 25. Oh, that is a lot actually. I am more war score, I have the most war score, so I will just take London now. Okay, so now it's peace conference. Uh, I will create a puppet of every... Every country, like this. I take all states, deselect one state, puppet, and then to this. Okay. Okay, um, now I have more than enough to do a world conquest. Um, I make 10 tanks a day. Like, uh, my neck, I will end it here, but uh, my next move would be invading Germany when uh, uh, Barbarossa happens and uh, then kill Soviet Union, um, Japan and then USA and then just clean up. So that's how we do it as a minor country. That's it. Good luck on your world conquest and uh, subscribe and like. Thank you. Bye.